All right. If if the scenario you're dealing with is this, that you recorded something and it's just a single mono track. So if you play it, it looks something like this on the lower right. So I'm in the edit page and you can see I've got, you can see what's going on there is that just one side is playing one speaker. So if this is your problem and you want to turn this into a stereo so it plays out of both speakers, continue watching this video. All right, I'm going to show you two ways to do this. The first is from the edit page, which is where I am. And the second is from the Fairlight page. So if you want to do this from the edit page, what you can do is go over to your effects. If you don't have it up, just click effects at the top here. It'll pop up. And then under audio effects, you want way down here at the bottom is stereo fixer. Click that and drag it and drop it onto the right. Now, when you do it this way, what it's going to do is it's going to apply it to this clip. So let's say, for example, you have multiple clips. Okay, so like I've got two clips here, right? One and two. If I drag and drop it onto this first one, it's only going to apply to the first one and not the second one, which might be what you want to do. But let's say you want to apply it to the whole track. Well, to do that, you need to go to the Fairlight page. So let me undo all of that and jump over to Fairlight. Now in Fairlight, where you do this from is you do it from your effects over here on the right with your mixer. So again, if you're not seeing the mixer, just click where it says mixer on the top and you might not see it as well. Um, sometimes if you've got multiple tracks, you'll need to click and kind of pull it out. In mine, I've only got one track, so I don't need to do that. So you see this option here, it says effects, click this little plus symbol, go all the way down to tools, and there you'll see stereo fixer again. Now what it's gonna do from here is it's gonna apply it to that whole track versus just the clip. All right, now once you get this up, whether you do it from the edit page or the Fairlight page, it doesn't matter. The options you have in here are stereo, which you know we don't care about because that's what we're already in. Reverse stereo, what this is gonna do is this is actually just gonna flip the sides. So it's basically gonna put your left one on your left and your right one on your right. We don't want that either. Mono is gonna convert it from stereo to mono. So if that's your issue, you wanna go from stereo to mono, that's where you would go. And we've got left only. This is actually the one I want because I know from when I was playing it, I could see in the edit page and you can see there that it's on the left side, not the right side. So I wanna say left only, click on that and what it's gonna do is it's gonna take the mono track from the left and copy it to the right. So when I hit play now, you can see I've got this video. Look at that, it's playing on both sides equally. Now you can adjust the outputs for each side as well if you want. And um, you know maybe you want your left a bit louder than a right or a bit louder, you can do that. Uh, two more here is we've got right only, so that's the opposite. If maybe yours is on the right side, you wanna record it to the left. And then we have this last one here, which is mid side, which I have no idea what that does. So I'm sure some uh, YouTube geek or uh, somebody who actually read the manual will know what that one does. But the ones I generally use are going to be this one right here to solve this specific problem. So there you go. That's it. If you have a mono track and you want to turn it into a stereo track, that's where you do it.